Temperatures surging well into the 40s, in some cases the 50s this afternoon. A little milder south versus some of the neighborhoods to the north. Let's head south of town right now to Bethel Park, Hillcrest Christian Academy. Temperature there still 49 degrees. A south southeast wind coming in. An hour. 48 in Charleroi, Carnegie reporting 50 degrees. And in Harrison City, Penn Trafford High School, 51 degrees downtown. It's 45 right now, a mostly cloudy sky, southeast wind at 6 miles an hour. Not much movement in temperatures tonight. You'll have clouds overhead and mild air in place. I think we'll hold pretty steady in the mid 40s through midnight. Maybe a little bit of a dip late night. We'll list low temperatures probably right around 42 to 45 degrees across the area, and then they quickly bounce back tomorrow morning. You can see by 10 a.m. already to 50 degrees in Washington, 49 in Moon. Greensburg and Morgantown up to 54 degrees by that time. 3 o'clock in the afternoon, 60 degrees in Morgantown. Most other places in that mid to upper 50 degree range through the day tomorrow as that southerly flow continues to usher in that milder air throughout the day. Now, it's going to be mild, but it's not going to be a real pretty day. I think there's going to be a lot of clouds around. We start things at 7 o'clock tomorrow morning. Clouds thickening over the course of the afternoon, and you can see by this time tomorrow, around this time, the leading edge of some rain showers arriving in the area, especially for areas west of Pittsburgh, may take a little longer or will take a little longer for areas to the east. And then we'll see occasional periods of rain tomorrow night and into the day on Friday. Commute Friday morning. It's going to be damp, but it's going to be mild. Temperatures will likely still be in the 50s. And then later in the day, the atmosphere begins to cool. We may sneak in the afternoon commute without any issues as likely we'll start to be some mixing around 5 o'clock in parts of Beaver in Lawrence County, but not yet in the city. It may take a little longer, so we may sneak in that afternoon commute with any potential travel related issues not occurring until we get into Friday night and maybe some carryover into Saturday. Precipitation type Friday night. This is based on the current track and speed. The pink area is where we're most likely to see some mixing. The blue area where it's mostly going to be snow and the green area is where it's mostly going to be rain. And this obviously will impact how much snow you could get out of the system as it passes by noon on Saturday. In and around the Pittsburgh area, a swath of about two to three inches. Higher totals as you get north. Newcastle, for example, could see as much as five to six inches of snow, and especially points north of there, while much less down around Uniontown and into parts of Fayette, Greene County, a coating to maybe just an inch of snow. And again, this all wraps up by noontime on Saturday. Here's the breakdown on future cast. Again, a southerly flow. Mild air stays in place through the day tomorrow into the day on Friday with the atmosphere beginning to cool as we head toward Friday evening and Friday night. And thankfully, the system is moving quickly, so it's again going to be gone by midday on Saturday. So the forecast tonight, mostly cloudy skies, mild 42, the low temperature. Some places may get no lower than 45. Then tomorrow, the high 58, mostly cloudy skies, breezy, mild day. The extended forecast Friday. 52 with mainly rain showers occasionally during the day and then changing to that wintry mix Friday evening and Friday night. Saturday morning you'll wake with a period of snow showers which will end by noon and that 30 degree temperature Saturday will be a morning high as temperatures then gradually fall in the afternoon. On Sunday, mostly cloudy skies, a dry day, but a cold one for the Steelers and Jags with a high of 21.